guys, this is Sabella. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my everyday makeup routine and it's going to be for this look right here. Um, it takes me about like 20 minutes to do. Um, I'm sorry for the lack of videos, but I will be posting more soon. So I've just been like, I have, I don't know, I've had like a slump and I've just been like wanting to live life in the moment and stuff. So I've just been not posting, but I am trying my best to post as often as I possibly can. Um, yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoy my everyday makeup routine. And, and without further ado, we're going to go ahead and jump right in. The first thing I'm going to do is take my First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream and apply that to my face to moisturize. Sorry if I sound sick. It's because I kind of am. I started a job at a daycare. Anyway. So the next thing I am applying on my face is the Hangover RX Primer by Too Faced and this has no silicone so it's really good for your skin if you don't want silicone and oily face. Um, the next thing I'm going to use is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation and the shade Ivory and the light shade as you can see right here. I'm just applying that with my um, Real Tiny sponge type thing and I'm going to apply that all over my face. Okay, next I'm taking two concealers I'm loving right now. This is the Fit Me Concealer and then the Tape Shape Concealer. And I think I'm going to use the Tape Shape first. I don't remember exactly, but I love the Tape Shape Concealer so much. So yes, I'm going in with the Tape Shape Concealer and making a little triangles underneath my eyes and blending that out. This is a really high coverage concealer. Some people I've heard have used it as a foundation. Honestly, I can't do that because it dries so fast, but this product works really well. Next, after I t applied the tape shape concealer, or the shape tape, I keep calling it the wrong thing, whatever, shape tape concealer. I'm gonna apply the Fit Me Concealer by Maybelline onto my blemishes and making sure that nobody can really see my pimples because I've been breaking out a lot lately because of school and stuff like that and like life in general so I'm just playing that and funny. Now I'm taking my new favorite powder. This is a better skin Maybelline powder and it's really good. It's kind of like a foundation type powder where it gives you color. Um this is my first colored powder. I've been using translucent for a while but I'm just applying that with my real technique powder brush all over my face now onto brows so this is the brow wiz and i just got this like a few weeks ago because i found this video like two weeks ago um <clears throat> sorry but i just feel like my brows in like that i really like how natural that my brows look in this with this product so as i continue to fill in my brows really fast um leave a comment below letting me know how your day has been because I had a really brutal week. First job at first week at my daycare job and I already got sick. Anyway, so now I'm taking my modern renaissance palette. Um, I love this palette. I love the pinky shades that it brings and the like burgundy colors and all that. I love how it brings all that to your eyes and they just give you a beautiful selection of color. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm taking Primavera. Like I said, I'm taking Primavera right now and um, just applying that to my lid for my lid color. And the next thing I'm gonna apply is the like the color I always just pronounce. Oh, put it on the screen. But it's like a purple. Like it's like the color of the palette on the front. And I'm just gonna like apply that to my crease. I really like this color for a crease. Uh, it's such a simple look. Next, I'm gonna be applying, I think, from here into my corners and my eyes. And I'm gonna take Hula Bronzer and a Morphe brush and just contour my face. Yes, I've been using the fan technique. I think it really works for my face. Yep, it does. And, um,. It really helps me get in the areas that I can't get in with normal brushes or that look, make it look messy with other brushes. So I really like this brush a lot for that. Now I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush and say Shade Exposed. I love this blush so much. 
as you can tell, I'm like applying a lot of it on. But um, I love Tarte in general because Tarte's like my favorite brand because my boyfriend Zach has celiac and so he can't have gluten. And I don't know, whenever he kisses me on the face, I just want to make sure that, you know, he, I mean, I don't know. I just think it's cool that Tarte's gluten free and whatnot. So yeah, now I'm taking my Amazoni, no, my um, Becca highlight in Champagne Pop. Of course, we all love this. And thanks, Jacqueline Hill, for making it. Um, I'm just gonna apply this. Sorry if you heard that sound. My parents are making downstairs. Um, but I'm gonna apply this to all of my, um, all of the places that light hits my face to make sure that it looks really glowing. Next, I'm taking the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and applying a few coats of this. Um, and normally what I've been doing, I'm gonna include in this video, is I spray my face with the Urban Decay uh, setting spray, like Lasso Night Spray or whatever it's called. And then I do my mascara because I found that it doesn't mess up my face. I'm just applying that. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I sound really sick. I feel like I struck the cold. But now, what I'm gonna do is get my hair down. Or, first, I'm gonna put my setting spray on because it's beautiful like that. And I'm just gonna apply that. I feel like miss, like a lot of miss actually. And then I'm do my hair to get the full look. Okay guys, this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a huge thumbs up for me and leave a comment down below letting me know if you wanna see more makeup tutorials or like, um, I don't know, just leave me requests down below. Um, I'm going to do my best to film a night routine. Yeah, because I've been wanting to do that for a while. And yeah, leave me any other video requests you guys may have and yeah, I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!